Welcome back. Today we're at Alatoona Creek Park in Ackworth, Georgia. I've heard about this place. I've almost come out here a couple times, but never have. I figured, why not today? Plan for today is just explore a little bit and see what they got out here. I'm heading over to Pitner Road Skills Park right now to check that out. I think I've seen a video or two of it, but I'm not really sure what's over there, so that'll be fun. Anyway, we're just cruising around, seeing what's out here. So let's go. We're at the top of Red Baron, and some of you may have noticed I'm on the Spark today. Heard it was pretty mellow out here, so decided it'd be a good opportunity to take it out again. I've been riding the Enduro for a week-ish, and this bike already feels so different. It feels like a little bike, which it is comparatively, I guess, but it feels a lot different. It's weird after only a week of riding the Enduro, coming back to this. I don't know if I can get up that. <laughs> Let's try. Let's see. I think I might be able to. Ooh, big rim ding. Nice. I typically like to climb a lot before I descend and usually not a huge fan of bi-directional trails, but so far these wooden features are keeping me entertained. Got Northwest Coast features in the Southeast Coast. <laughs> okay, so we're over at the Pitner Road Skills Park, and I guess we'll just start with Bravo. There's Alpha and Bravo, and I guess B would be the easier one. I don't know. So I'm thinking that those lines I saw down there were the second half of Bravo. So we're gonna try that. No. So where does this go? All right, I'm going up this one just cause I've got to know. So this is Whippersnapper. I 
mean, this just goes forever. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be really going this way, but... Alright, so we went that way on Whippersnapper last time. And I think this is just another Whippersnapper line, I guess. cool I'm blown away I wasn't expecting this at all I was thinking there were gonna be some like little skinnies which there were and jumps like this size but there's some pretty pretty good lines out here from what I saw so that's really cool all right so that's it for Pitna Road skills area so we came over to the other side and we're gonna do MoFlo, Knuckle Sandwich, and Medusa. They get increasingly more difficult apparently as you go, so we'll start with MoFlo. Not bad. So there's some alternate lines off of Medusa. That's one of them. And this is the other line. There's some other lines on Medusa, but 
that are all pretty similar to that last one I just did, so I'm not gonna show them all. So I went out of order because I was having trouble clearing these knuckle sandwich jumps. So this is my last attempt no matter what. That was almost bad. That's gonna be it. That's pretty good. I just almost made a big mistake there, so can't keep pushing it. I'm getting tired. I wish I'd been able to do that one. It's a little frustrating, but I feel like I can. Just didn't today, so anyway, that's gonna be it for the video. This place is pretty cool. I really wasn't expecting much at all because the trails just on Trail Forks didn't look that insane. But for what it's worth, I had a good time out here. So come out here, check it out. There's a whole lot of things to do. So I didn't even finish half the trails, I don't think. And I've been out here for almost three hours. So anyway, as always, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.